New technology is advancing telemedicine and enabling an ultrasound right from home. Rich Jamiro explains in today's TechSmart. Rich, good morning to Hi, you, Rich. sir. Hey, good morning to you, Chris. Good morning to you, Megan. Pretty incredible if you think about this. Most of the time right now, if you have an appointment with your doctor via telehealth, it's probably just a video chat. But now thanks to new guidelines from the FDA that expand the reach of technology when it comes to telemedicine, one company is now allowing doctors to perform ultrasounds on a patient who's not even in the same room. Augmented reality expanding beyond fun and games. Medical startups increasingly using it to move healthcare forward. One of the applications that most excites us is the ability now to bring ultrasound in a controlled way to the home. Butterfly IQ makes a popular portable ultrasound probe that plugs into a mobile device like an iPhone or iPad. It allows doctors to perform medical imaging anywhere. We sometimes think of it as the first major update to the stethoscope. Now the company is expanding the reach of their product, thanks to new policies from the FDA in response to the COVID-19 crisis. They expand telemedicine beyond basic video chat. Butterfly is launching a new teleguidance platform that lets a patient scan themselves while a doctor guides the process from afar. We wanted to avoid things like move left, my left, your left. It, it gets messy quickly. The system uses augmented reality. A patient follows virtual arrows superimposed over their body on screen guiding the scanner to where doctors need to look. And we can see that it's thickened and irregular. In a demo, I watched a live examination of the lungs. Since COVID-19 attacks their tissue in a specific way, ultrasound tech has been instrumental in diagnosis. I think we're finding, much like we're finding that much of our work can be done remotely, that much of medicine can be done over telemedicine as opposed to a discreet office visit. In the near future, a virtual checkup might be more than just a video chat. When we have telemedicine that can enable the same quality of care that's possible in a hospital, then I think that's a real milestone for society and for technology. All right, now this handheld scanner costs about $2,000, so it's not something the average consumer is going to run out to purchase, uh, but that's about 50 times less than your typical cart-based ultrasound machine. I'd love to know what you think about this. You can find me on my Facebook page, facebook.com slash richontech. Uh, Megan and Chris, let me give you one scenario. Let's say you run a nursing care facility. You can have one of these devices in your facility to allow doctors to check up on those patients without transporting them anywhere which is pretty neat, pretty amazing. Uh, I would draw the line though at taking my own blood. If they asked me to yeah. do that, I'd probably be like, I'll just go to the office. That might get a little <laughs> much. A little much. Yeah, good word. Yeah. Uh, but I think one thing that we've all discovered, it was already in existence, but I think it's exploded in popularity, is telemedicine. So uh, I think we'll see a lot oh, more absolutely. of that. absolutely. I think during this, during this pandemic, I think almost everyone has actually experienced a, a video call with their doctor when they've probably never done that before. Exactly. Rich, you're the man. Thank Have a good you, day, Rich. buddy. All right, let's go to Henry. Uh, having